There is a new bill that's being uh, introduced and being uh, advanced by the Republicans in Frankfurt. Uh, they want to pick the next U.S. senator is kind of what it comes down to. SB 228, uh, which got a little bit of coverage last week. It is a, a bill to change the current system, which has been in existence, I think, forever. Uh, that if a, if a senator, uh, U.S. senator, if that seat is at, uh, goes vacant during the term of the senator, like, you know, if somebody retires or somebody dies, you know, uh, then the governor appoints somebody to, to fill out the remainder of that, of that term. Apparently, a lot of Republicans in Frankfurt saw Mitch in his black hands uh, and uh, have gotten nervous that he might not see out the end of his uh, six-year term, and they really don't want Andy to pick the replacement. So this bill would absolutely upend the existing system and ensure that the uh, that the legislature uh, played uh, the you know, preeminent role in selecting who would uh, who would see, uh, fill out the remainder of that term. Which again, it's not broke. There's no need for this. It's just a power grab. It's just making sure that Andy doesn't have the ability to you know put in somebody rational and reasonable to uh, see out the end of the Grim Reaper's term. Uh, if he does, in fact, go to meet the Grim Reaper, uh, which, you know, that doesn't look that healthy. So I can see why they're a little bit nervous about it. But I do think that this is an overreach, which, of course, you know, it's not really an overreach. If they keep doing the exact thing, same thing over and over again, you know, that's just their MO. That's what they're doing in Frankfurt. You know, Republicans are trying to claw back every ounce of power possible from Andy Bashir, you know, who's just done a remarkable job of keeping us safe. So, yeah, why not just screw that up, huh, guys? All right, so that's what uh, the uh, the call to action is. So call those lovely, lovely people at the legislative comment line, the nicest humans you will ever talk to and give them your message. Reject SB 228. Let Andy pick the next senator if that's what it comes down to. Uh, stop your shameless power grab, House Republicans. <laughs>